pursuit now and getting into some traffic on this Friday. People's trying to start their weekends off early out there in Cali. We do appreciate everyone joining us here on News Now as we continue to always bring you the top stories here of the day. And of course, breaking news when it does occur, we will wait and see just how this is all going to unfold. Police suspect just pull over, end this right here safely. You just never know what a suspect is going to do. That's that's the issue. If they're not willing to stop, what else are they going to do? And that's what police have to put in total in total effect. They got to think about this. So heavy traffic, but not enough to stop this individual. We'll see how it unfolds. This is one of those chases where it's just like, okay, the suspect's not weaving in and out of lanes here. He doesn't even really have the opportunity to do so with all the traffic. Usually we'll see it a little bit earlier in the day, in the afternoon, maybe in the morning, where it's uh, definitely maybe more open roads here and you could see more of the action here. But this is more of just a bizarre police chase where, uh, I mean, we're just going about 40 miles per hour, maybe even less than that as we uh, continue to wait and see how this is all going to unfold. Let's see what this next move is. I mean, is he gonna get off on a exit here? Go through some residential areas? Who knows? Okay, so then chat right now are saying wow this is just so weird you know usually we see individuals who are really trying their best to get away and this guy just seems like it's a, a Sunday stroll here Station D. We'll see if they could pan out here. Hopefully Sky Fox could pan out and just show us what the traffic does look like from, uh, there we go. Thank you, thank you Sky Fox for always listening. So that's what we're looking at right now. You see some police there in the background, but he's still trying to find a way, trying to, oh, okay, we got this, got this pickup truck just trying to get in his way here. Maybe he's trying to put a stop to it. Yeah, he's definitely brake checking. Okay, now we're getting into some, going a little bit faster here now. Now it's picking up. Now the suspect senses that the police were behind him and now here we go and, and it is on folks. Now it is on. I was saying, this is, this is a weird setup here. I was like, do they have the right car? Okay, let's see, he's getting off on it off the highway here. More traffic though, that's California for you. All right, now we're in residential zones here and this is what you gotta worry about too because now they're gonna start running red lights here and that's any intersection they blow past, that's the recipe for 
some bad crashes. And we've seen that before in the past, even one right here in Tempe, Arizona, I'd say about a year and a half ago. Oh, is he going in a parking structure? Is that the deal here? It's a little, so you got a helipad on that um, building right there too. All right, Sky Fox, find, find the car here. Now you can see the trail of uh, police there, all following this individual. Which way is it going to go? How is it going to come on? Come on, Sky Fox, there we go. This is bizarre, guys. Under. This is testing my patience. Hmm. Give me, get me a water. We're gonna be here. Hmm. This is, this, guys. This is just a weird chase. We, we we've done many and many, and this is just. I mean, Sky Fox is losing the car. Here we go. Is this it? <laughs> and it's on again. Here we go. He was thinking about maybe that parking structure decided not because he was going so slow into it. Uh, by then, all the police officers were right there. Let's go. Is he going to stay in a neighborhood that he knows or is he going to venture out? What's this guy doing? And you can see that the police are just going to wait until this guy either gives up or crashes or something because they don't want to press him. Looks like they're just letting him do his thing. We continue to wait. Going very slow. O obeying all speed limits here. More traffic. And here's the thing, the way that we're watching this is the police aren't pressing him, so he doesn't feel like he has to do any kind of crazy maneuvers right now. This is the weirdest traffic spot I've seen. Yeah. Thanks to all our viewers here for also chiming in and saying, yeah, this is weird. We've seen high profile chases. We've seen fast speed ones. I mean, I've seen ones in 18 wheeler. We've seen it in a stolen RV. We've seen it so many different things. And this one is just a slow move. Okay, police getting out. Let's see, are they gonna put a stop to this? Because you just don't know what this guy's going to do. Okay, we got... I mean, that car in front of him is really trying to hamper him down. You could, you could tell that by just going super slow, but here we go. Chase continues. If you haven't already done so, hit that subscribe button. That way you'll always be in the know when we are live and probably covering police chases here for you from around the country. If it doesn't happen in California, it's going to happen in Texas. And if not in Texas, it's probably a good chance that it's happening here in Arizona. So thank you. Mike Page, the voice of police chases. Happy to be here with you on this uh, Friday afternoon. We are watching this all unfold in Los Angeles. Suspect now picking up a little bit more speed. They're going a little bit over that speed limit right now. Excuse me, 
but we haven't seen really anything erratic. I mean, how can you win? Okay, going in a, going around the corner here. What is this, like a gas station? And it continues. All right, that was the most, at this point, that's the most dramatic thing that we've seen this guy do. He's gonna give up soon. I've seen these before, folks. Don't worry. Just don't go, just don't be slamming through intersections, putting people at risk here. Please don't do that. Now he's on the bumper, that guy. Okay, here we go. We're picking up steam here. You can hear it in the newsroom. They're all watching too. Wanna see how this is all going to unfold and Watch the conclusion right here only on News Now. Yeah, we have one viewer already chime in, says slowest police chase ever. Yeah, it's a little different, isn't it? Traffic, traffic. Mm. I mean, this could really go on for a while, too, if you think about it. Ten minutes ago, I thought this was going to wrap up. But if this guy has a good amount of gas, and they're not be he's not being pressed by the police, we could see this go on for 90 minutes. This is it's like a Sunday drive. We continue to wait here. You can see now that we have uh, the mile per hour counter on there. Here we go, pit maneuver by the police. We've got the pit maneuver. There you go, it was about at 40 miles per hour. Here we go, this is your chance, officers, to get this wrapped up. Let's see, is, it, is he going to flip it in reverse here? That's, that's one thing. I didn't put him out of commission though. But it looks like he, I, I sort of saw that car door pop open. Just don't ram them. Just please don't ram them. Tense situation, okay, let's see. And it's a woman, everyone. 